right, we're back in Fallout 4 today. Quests for today? I have no clue. Uh, <laughs> we really don't have that many quests. Uh, we don't want to do that because that starts the mission. Um, there's no point in doing that really. We could do that. We could go help dance. Cold swear might not be too bad. There's a lot of ghouls, but um, some free mines lying around, so. So we could go do that. I'm sorry, I'm gonna be funny today because this is hay fever. I think we'll go help Dan's out. Still not entirely sure who to go with. Oh yeah, by the way, I did fill up every every bottle I had, which was like, well, I'll show you. Yeah, I made a lot. Over a hundred. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Probably shump, shump? some sh stuff. I, I you, you're so weird, lovey. But I hate you. Sun looks uh, very much like a smudge today. To um to College Square, which is like there. We no longer need to worry about water. We are good for water forever. Uh, the other thing we need to worry about is getting diseased. I need to up my lock picking. I really do, because uh it's helpful on a lot of places. So you know what? We'll do another lock picking next. Because we can't even do advanced locks on the road again, boys. Oh god, it takes so long to fucking travel in this game. Fuck. Seriously, again? Fuck, where is it? <laughs> is it shit? I missed. Missed a few times there. Hello. I can rest easy knowing that Wolfgang is rotten in hell. Thank you. Okay, yeah, please. I'll take a look, sure. Uh, what's in there? Because. It's either one of like three things. It's either wild mongrels, rat scorpions, or a yaogai. Not exactly a risk I want to take. Or the fourth thing, uh, the two people who stay there are still alive and haven't been killed by one of those three things. Uh, my biggest fan out there wants to make uh, fan art and uh, animations and stuff of my characters, so here you go, here's my face, giving you a pan. Little boy Jay will finally get to make his first fan art. After he's done making fan art for himself. Turn to that, why is there more rat trunks in my radio signal? Go sleep at Overland. Let's go. Alright, College Square, there she is. Oh my god, there's two. Jesus Christ. Alright, I knew there'd be landmines, but I didn't know they'd be that close. Jesus Christ, someone doubled up on all the mines. Uh oh. Oh god, we did it. You know what's getting attention? There's other stuff popping. You were very determined. Good effort. Ooh, you begin. Yeah, I thought that was gonna happen. Ooh, man. Easy enough. I hope Dance is a patient man. <laughs> Cause um he's gonna have to be. Oh, hello. <laughs> Okay. You're a fucking strong. 
strong one. Are you kidding me? Where the hell did he come from? God fucking damn it. <sighs> well, we just lost about 30 minutes of progress. Okay. Clear everywhere before we go for him. I didn't know it was going to be uh, like a legendary one. I didn't know he was going to be legendary. In fact, that was worse than legendary. What's the skull mean? What is the skull? Is it epic? Is it an epic enemy? I don't know. We didn't. We still didn't even get to the bit of helping Dan's. That was literally just clearing out College Square. <laughs> Dog meat. I was, the point was luring them out, not going in there like fucking Rambo. Fucking moron. <laughs> Yes, dog meat. Thank you. I'm aware that there's ghouls in this area. Can you please stop fucking suicide? I can't see him on the map. On the on the fucking radar. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I swung first. <laughs> Where the fuck did you come from? I'm going to shoot myself in the fucking face. Fucking serious, don't we? that feral ghoul robo? It's there, I see it. There's a needle. Yeah! Oh, hello. <coughs> oh, yeah. That should be everywhere and everything except for the enemy. Yeah, I thought, I thought that might happen, that's why I was testing it. <laughs> yes. On the stairs. Our arms broke. Fantastic. Alright, we're good. 
Oh. We appreciate the assistance, civilian. Jesus Christ. What's your business? I here? don't want to fucking talk to you yet. Oh, really? Why the fuck do you do this, Tommy? Why do you run out here? Hi. Know what the fuck do you we do? appreciate the assistance, civilian. But what's your business here? I my prefer business. to keep my business to myself. Then, if there's nothing left to discuss, I suggest you leave our compound immediately. Okay. Paladin, have you decided to cooperate and tell me what brought you here? Well, if I say trying to survive, you're gonna call. You're gonna just say bullshit. So Before I answer, there. will you tell me who you are? In due time. If you want to remain in our compound, I suggest you answer my question first. Fucking hell, you're so fucking awkward. Pest exterminator. I heard you had a feral problem. Evading my questions is a surefire way of getting yourself ejected from the compound. Are you from a local settlement? I'm yeah. from Sanctuary Hills. On the other side of Concord? I've seen the location on our maps, but I've never visited the area myself. Oh, shit. There isn't much over there for us to collect. If I appear suspicious, it's because our mission here has been difficult. Since the moment we arrived in the Commonwealth, we've been constantly under fire. If you want to continue oh, pitching in, we could use an extra gun on our side. I'll yeah. continue to help, but you owe me an explanation first. Very well. I'm Paladin Dance, Brotherhood of Steel. Over there, describe Halen and Knight Reese. We're on recon duty, but I'm down a man and our supplies are running low. I've been trying to send a distress call to my superiors, but the signal's too weak to reach them. Sir, if I may... Proceed, Halen. I've modified the radio tower on the roof of the police station, but I'm afraid it just isn't enough. What we need is something that will boost the signal. Our target is ArcJet Systems, and it contains the technology we need, the deep range transmitter. We infiltrate the facility, secure the transmitter, and bring it back here. So what do you say? You willing to lend the Brotherhood of Steel a hand? <laughs> no time to waste. Let's get moving. Outstanding. Gonna go in there? So you gonna patch me up or what? I don't know. Field scribe Halen, personal log entry, 324A. I'm starting to wonder if joining the Brotherhood of Steel was a good choice. I originally signed up seeking protection and comradeship, but I'm worried that I've traded away a bit of my humanity in the process. The Brotherhood's message of hope for the future is idealistic and noble, but their methods leave a lot to be desired. The leadership seems especially misguided. Instead of diplomacy, they wield violent confrontation to exert control. Despite all that, I've been successfully avoiding the fighting by following the career path of a field scribe. I suppose only time will tell how long I can stand the sight of spilled blood over my own moral fiber. Are you fucking kidding me? Dog me, you're fucking useless. You can barely carry anything. Jesus fucking Christ. Hello team. Captain Widmark here. Welcome to the task force. Operation Winter's End starts now with you. Together we will oh, knock Eddie Winter off his throne and dump his sorry ass in a 2,000 volt easy chair. It should come as a surprise to no one that our operations in Boston have been, in a word, compromised. Winter has eyes everywhere, even the BPD. So, our brothers across the river in Cambridge have been kind enough to let us use the Cambridge Police Department as our base of operations. Let's get to work. Good hunting. Why are you standing around here like there's nothing to do? Paladin Dance is waiting for you. Give me one second. They'll squash pretty good when you stomp on their heads in power armor. You didn't even get angry. <laughs> Fuck you. Reese. Fuck you. Paladin. Ready to move out? Ready? Ready? Outstanding. Follow me and try not to lag behind. We better get a move on. It's not a good oh, idea to keep Paladin there waiting. Flip. 
Park Jet is a short hike to the west. If we take this road, we should be able to avoid the larger packs of ferals infesting Cambridge. Uh, fuck me. Well, I dealt with them, so. This way. Yeah, fucking straight. It might surprise oh, yeah. you to learn that my recon team isn't the first to visit the Commonwealth. Over the last seven years, two other teams were sent here by the yes, Brotherhood please. to gather technology. The first team's mission was a huge success. They came back with crates full of pre war artifacts and historical documents. The second wasn't so fortunate. Shortly after they arrived, we lost contact with them. <clears throat> heard from them. As far as my team goes, we've lost four good men to this godforsaken wasteland. It's been a target from the moment we arrived. But despite our setbacks, I don't intend to give up and head home. Or end up missing. <laughs> Do you shut the fuck up? I don't, I don't care. No, oh. That's the one. I'd do well to shoot you in the fucking face, you little bitch. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. Dance? Look at these wrecks. It appears as though the facility's automated security's already been dealt with. Is this the Brotherhood of Steel's handiwork? Unfortunately, no. Look at the evidence. <coughs> there isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These robots were assaulted by instant sin. Is there any option that I can choose that doesn't turn you into a condescending prick? I'll be on the lookout. Roger that. Let's move out. Please tell me there's somewhere I can rest before we do this. There's absolutely no way. So, be aware. If I do die in here, I will be sent all the way back to the police station. Why the heck are they making us record this? Oh crap, it's on, isn't it? <laughs> um, this is Technician Rand, Arc Jet Propulsion Division. I'm here with Technician Janowski, work log A1190. <laughs> Janowski and I have been working on the Mars Shot Project for about three months now, and I think we have the thrust calculations worked out. Man, I wish I was headed up there with those guys. It'd be nice to get the hell away from our lousy planet. Hey, easy. If we don't record these logs properly, we're gonna get fired. The supervisor is already itching to get rid of us. Especially since it's taking us longer than we promised. So what? We've been drafted anyway. We're shipping out in a few weeks, remember? <laughs> Soon we'll be doing push-ups, eating freeze-dried rations, and just wishing we were spending our day inside a cushy private laboratory. Of course I remember. But I'm trying not to imagine getting my head blown off when I'm on the front line, and keeping my mind on work is helping me deal with the problem. Maybe that doesn't make sense to you, but it's important to me, okay? All right. I'm sorry. Look, why don't you toss this tape, and we'll start a new one. Get ready. I don't think we're alone. Movement detected. Curious. Okay. Hostile set in danger. Hostile life form. I know there's a tear. Oh god, he's dead. Attacking enemy. Attacking enemy. You know what? I'm fine with Dan's just destruction. Oh, seriously? Well, you can go bloody fight him. Yeah, I'm not risking that. I'm just gonna go ahead and let Dan deal with that. <laughs> I'll have a peek down. Yeah. I think that's it. 
It's got to be one bed in here. Sounds like Gans is in a bit of a pickle over there, but you know what? I don't really care. You can do one. Sounds like he's dealt with it. Oh. Excellent. The transmitter should be in the control room at the top of the core. But it looks like the elevators are dead. We'll have to keep heading down for now. Find a way to get the facility's power back online. There has to be a oh, power no backup system somewhere. Scout the maintenance area along the main chamber. There's the junk chat. Don't really want to pick that Hearing up though, because one, I'm never going to use it. And two, it's going to run a ton, so. Oh, he graduated all right from high school. It's fine, I'm sure he took shop class. Oh look, he's reading the science mags, how cute. Har har har. Shop class, let's see them make this in shop class. My marvel of engineering. The finest in weaponized refuse acceleration. My beauty, my junk jet. They'll see, the engineers with their suits and Fusion door. There's literally no beds. So if I die, I can't die. Like, I, 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 I need to not die. To know. Engine core power restored. <laughs> Thermal engine fueled, primed, and standing by for uh, your command. Kill that. Command accepted. Commencing five second countdown. I'm just gonna stand five, here and do nothing about this. Four. Three. Two. One. Engine firing. That was optional. Oh my god! Are you alright? Got cooked by those flames. But thanks to my power armor, I'm still in one piece. The important thing is that we're still alive. We have a way to get to the transmitter. Let's go. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Hey, over here. Going up. Come on, you piece of scrap. Hostiles have retreated. I hope that's the last of them. Damn it. I don't yes. see the anywhere. It turns out she dealt with them. Let's get out of here. We'll take the service elevator to the surface. Where's dog meat? <laughs> no, you know what screw dog meat. Going it's not. Up. What? What do you mean dog's going to sanctuary? But he he didn't need healing. Did he fall? He, he, I bet he fell off. He, the he's talking to the bed here. Let's move out. Be kind. Well, that could have gone smoother, but mission accomplished. I thought we worked well as a team. Agreed. It's a refreshing change to work with a civilian who can follow orders properly. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to discuss. First and foremost, if you'll hand me the deep range transmitter, I'd like to compensate you for your assistance during this operation. I think you'll find this weapon useful. 
It's my own personal modification of the standard Brotherhood laser rifle. May it serve you well in battle. Noise. I'm pretty sure you just made me over encumbered with it. That isn't necessary. I insist you keep it. The Brotherhood will need pay. Right. Now, okay, as far as the second matter goes, I wanted to make you a proposal. We had a lot thrown at us. Army drink first? Jesus. Our op could have ended in disaster. But you kept your cool and handled it like a soldier. There's no doubt in my mind that you've got what it takes. The way I see it, okay. you've got Never a explosion. Cool. You can spend the rest of your life wandering from place to place. Trading an extra yeah. hand for a meager reward. Or, you could join the Brotherhood of Steel and make your mark on the world. So, what do you say? I feel like doing it. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to. to join. I'm going to join That's the Brotherhood. I wanted to hear. Meet me back I've joined the them like a billion station. times already, but... Come on. They've got a, they've got a bloody robot. A big robot. We're going to go back to... I guess we'll go to Grey Garden. And then we'll go to Overland. Okay. So that's what the explosion. No, 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 I don't want to be involved. I don't want to be involved. Run, 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 run. We're just, we're just gonna go to Oberland. Sleep before we die horribly and lose uh, about an hour and a half's worth of progress. I can rest easy knowing that Wolfgang is rotten in it. You say this every single time, I do not care. Oh, finally back once again. Alright, that's where I'm going to end this episode today. If you did enjoy, please like the video, and if you're new and like, want to see more, please Your subscribe. And uh, shut the fuck up, Mama Murphy. And we'll see you in the next episode. I'm getting some exercise. Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh.